Sebastian, come here. 60-year-old Antoinette Williams right lives alone in Northeast Atlanta, <laughs> but with three rescue cats, it's a full house. <laughs> There's Baldy and her sister Gracie, who was too shy to make an appearance. Hello. And the kitty Sebastian. Quit scratching me. Who's a bit of a rascal. Get away from my flower. Are you a cat lady? Well, I'm a cat and a dog lady. And on this day, Miss Antoinette has a few special visitors. Hey. Some folks from Meals on Wheels Atlanta. How are you today? Oh, Miss Antoinette is on a fixed income. She's had kidney trouble and is recovering from a hip replacement. So three days a week, Meals on Wheels volunteers like Terry Davis deliver her dinner. But they also bring cat food. It's a big help because it saved me a lot. Meals on Wheels has been delivering nourishing food to seniors in Fulton County for 50 years. Four years ago, they started delivering dog and cat food too. Over 2,500 pounds last year. Carrie Morrison, Director of Volunteer Services, explains. So for a lot of our seniors, they're well below the poverty level and supporting an animal is very, very hard for them. What we were finding was that they were giving their meals to their, uh, their animals. But now, with donations from the Atlanta Humane Society and Banfield Charitable Trust, Meals on Wheels is helping feed both to... In October, we had Polish sausage, yeah. kibasi, mm. and four-legged clients. And it's their favorite, Sebastian. So what kind of a difference has that made for you? It make a great difference. Because I'm telling you, like, some money I had to spend on them, I don't have to spend it now. I can do household stuff, you know. And then your medicine, you know. So I have money to get the help I need. And less worry about how to care for her furry family. What would you do without your kitties? I don't know. I ain't never did down him. I always had some kind of animal here since I was a little girl, so I don't know. It probably would be lonely because they are company. And for someone housebound, that company can make a world of difference. It seems like she's getting a tremendous amount of joy from being around her pets. Come in and brush it, Sebastian. So there she is, saving beautiful pets and creatures. Oh, and she's struggling herself, living on a fixed income and health issues. So it's it's a beautiful thing to be, uh, be able to um, serve her and, and to see her be able to take care of her pets. <laughs> he is. In Northwest Atlanta, I'm Andy Larner, Fox 5 News.